It's one of the last signs of McClellan Air Force Base, which shut its gates for good in 2001. The Army and Air Force Exchange Service has been a mainstay for active military members, veterans and their families for 20 years. We moved to the Sacramento area because there were so many very nice Air Force bases that we could use in our time of retirement. But now Marty Hills and her Navy retired husband are running out of options with the closing of the BX Exchange, a place that offers deep discounts and tax-free household items, goods and clothing. It also has restaurants and a barber shop. It was kind of a payback for those many, many months when our spouses were gone and serving overseas. So um, it made us feel blessed by the community and appreciate it. And uh, now, you know, it's dollars and cents. The sign hanging outside gives the reason for the BX closure. The absence of a military mission combined with a decrease in demand. I wish they'd keep it open because we use it. 80-year-old Navy veteran Ernest Granger and his 86-year-old Marine buddy Murray Wankel drive from their retirement community in Folsom for a day of shopping and errands. Well, it's close to us. We like to drive and we go in there and, and the prices are a little bit better than out here in the civilian world. These two veterans say they'll now drive to Travis Air Force Base for their weekly outings, but not every vet has transportation. The military community doesn't like the message this latest closure is sending. Our facilities here, again, are, are a way of saying thank you to those veterans. Now we reached out to the main exchange and are still waiting to receive a statement from them. Uh, the commissary, though, people were asking, is staying open. It is run by a different government appropriations. Now, this exchange, though, will close November 26th, and it's encouraging shoppers just to go online for the things they need. Reporting live in McClellan Park, Michelle Bandur, KCRA 3 News. All right, Michelle.